On Senior Day, the Terriers hosted the Bucknell Bison, looking to stay perfect in league play. BU took the lead after 15 minutes through Micah Ackroyd's penalty corner goal. This one, Petra Hall on the stop. Ackroyd shoots and scores. Great job there by Micah Ackroyd. The Terriers maintained their advantage going into the second half and tested Bucknell's Emily Finn, who made several key saves. Bucknell didn't create much, but threatened with a few second half corners, one of which was saved off the line by Ali Hamill. Comes to Maracas. A swing and saved off the line by Ali Hamill. That was a crisis averted right wow. there, but a great job by Hamill. BU would see out the win through stout defending and secured an undefeated conference record at 6-0. Up next, it's playoff time. The Patriot League tournament begins at noon on Friday as number one BU hosts number four Holy Cross. I'm joined now by Micah Ackroyd, score of the only goal in the one to nothing win over the Bucknell Bison. And Micah, I know coach said she's going to keep the corner set simple today. What did you see out there for your goal? Oh yeah, well, in the locker room, coach told us that stick side for the goalie was open and she put me on that spot for twice in a row and then she said if we get those two goals, we'll go for a third. But then in that, then the goalie will shift and then our third goal, our hope was going to be um, Hamill on post side. But I mean, it was lucky and like the other PCs, it was mistrapped, so we are lucky to get that one goal and you could see how they came back firing in the last five minutes, so we're just trying to get another one. And of course, senior day here as well, just four of them compared to a very large senior class last year. Just talk to me about what they've meant, especially in mentoring such a young team this season. Oh, wow. They've, they've done miles of mentoring for, that, for our nine freshmen. They've just been such great role models. It's so sad to see them leave, but um, they're honestly keeping it together really well. I thought they'll be bawling their eyes out by now. But after today's game, they still told us to sit back, reflect on this, and know that we can do even better. And so even when they're gone, we're going to be striving to do even better without them. And finally, you'll be back here at noon on Friday. Uh, what excites you most against the rematch with Holy Cross? Oh, man, Holy Cross. Um, well, honestly, just like I said, reflecting on what we can do better, we just have this feeling when we know that we play like boofers, and um, that's what we're going to try to accomplish on Friday. All right, thank you so much. Congratulations. Thanks, Alex. All right, I'm now joined by head coach Sally Starr after the one to nothing win over the Bucknell Bison. And coach, I think it's fair to say this is one of your more challenging games. It always kind of has been against Bucknell. Um, do you think it's it's good timing for this to come right before the postseason? Yeah, I mean, uh, credit to Bucknell. They, they competed hard. They challenged us for every possession, and they worked hard for their possessions as well. And I think, uh, you know, it wasn't a, you know, I'm not really thrilled with the way that we played today. But, you know, Buck, you got to credit Bucknell for um, knocking out, us out of our rhythm a little bit. But, again, we found a way to get a, a victory today. Um, we persevered. We um, defended really well. Uh, I think we really held them. Their corners can be very dangerous, so we really wanted to hold, limit their corners' opportunities. And we finished uh, regular season undefeated, which was definitely a, a goal coming into this game. So it wasn't, um, I'm not thrilled with the performance, but definitely happy with the outcome. Right, and these seniors now have never lost a regular season home game against a Patriot League team. Just how important have these four been to the program? Um, all four of them, um, you know, and I think their roles have changed over the four years. And I think um, they have really grown into outstanding hockey players, outstanding leaders, and outstanding teammates. You know, they're really going to be missed um, as people and friends more than anything else. And um, they're just really great hockey hockey players. So we really hope to keep um, one game at a time now. And um, we got the semifinal against Holy Cross. And um, we just want to keep, we want to perform better than we did today, play better than we play, did today, and um, have a good practice week and really prepare for a very good Holy Cross team. All right, Coach, thank you so much. Good luck on Friday. Great, thank you.